morning guys and welcome back to a new weekly vlog i hope you are all doing well so i'm starting off my weekly vlog on a tuesday i did do some little clips yesterday with the rhythm 108 event which was phenomenal i will go through the chocolate products with you if you are not aware of rhythm 108 it is incredible <laughs> delicious Nespresso coffee with my new MH Living coffee mug. I'm planning this morning to do a little bit of interior shooting which will be really lovely. I bought some flowers in the background as you can see and I just love them so much so yeah that's the plan for this morning. I've got a little bit of admin and editing to do before I get on with that so I made myself a coffee and that's what I'm gonna get on with but I hope you're all doing well and I hope you enjoy the vlog. So, I wanted to quickly chat through the chocolates with you guys. So, if you aren't aware of Ribbon 108, Ribbon 108 is a company based in Switzerland, in Geneva. Yesterday, I was very, very kindly invited along to do a class with their chocolatiers from Switzerland, which came over to teach us how to make some gorgeous, beautiful truffles, and it was just such a lovely event. The Ribbon 108 is a very incredible, conscious chocolate brand. They find um, organically they have fair trade farmers all their packaging is recycling and also as well they're a vegan company as well not only are they vegan but they really make sure that the ingredients which are in the within the chocolate is natural is healthy which is natural and kinder to our bodies and um, so they're a delicious luxurious treat um, but without the the bad quality ingredients they're all pure high quality ingredients which I really recommend Recommend. One of my favorite products they do are the biscuits. These are the coconut crunch. These are incredible. They also do some chocolates. Honestly, I kid you not, they are actually in the same award winning category as normal chocolates. So, when I mean normal, I meant like cow's milk, like you know, your classic chocolates. So, excluding that they are vegan, they are nominated one of the best, or like I think it was like a third or something. And I really recommend it. They also do, which I'm really excited for. I have a night in on my own on Friday, so I'm going to treat myself to one of these. These are the Ribbon 108 Consciously Crafted Delicious Swiss Vegan Hazelnut Chocolate Praline Soft Baked Build Cookie. And they are gluten-free as well. This is the chocolate peanut butter one as well. And then they have these, like, I feel like people would recognise these guys. These, like, little mini ones. More so, I feel like these ones are their most known. They're rebranded, so um, you might recognise the others. But, oh, these are delicious, and I feel like they're a really good size. And then they kindly gave me... I had to leave early, but they gave me the freshly made chocolatier truffles. Stunning, and we were celebrating, basically, their, their new product launch, which is the chocolate truffle selection. And so they wanted to create something which is like more of a treat more indulging sorry my face isn't in the camera so they've created this selection and it's all about that self-care moment like, and sharing with friends so they, obviously they create such beautiful products which you can share with friends but they're not designed to share with friends in a sense obviously that's sharing if people want to share but this is this is like something that you give as a christmas present as well yeah something you give us like a christmas present as well like something very sweet like even if you're doing like work experience i used to always bring a chocolates to, to the people who were employing me to have like to get the experience so this is a really nice way of like just presenting a gift i love giving chocolates and stuff as gifts and obviously there was a big gap in the market for vegan products so yeah very lovely so a massive massive thank you to river 108 for sending these over these are so delicious i kid you not if you've never tried ribbon 108 
go and get yourself some i think they're available i know they're definitely available in like whole foods and like kind of organic i think you can buy them online also just check online just type in rhythm 108 online and it will pop up where you can buy these i think also in holland about as well but yeah very lovely so i'm gonna put these away before i devour any but yeah i just wanted to give them a massive shout out because such an incredible brand just been doing a little reel of the shelving area just styling up some lovely pieces from mh living so what i've basically done is just put my phone on a timer and then i've just kind of each time just gone through and like done the separate i've done step by step like styling up shelving unit which i think looks really lovely so i will come over here and show you what we have so in the corner here, you'll recognize some of the pieces. So the beautiful brown lining print, the terracotta pot, the plates, the gorgeous kind of like bubble vase. And that just looks absolutely stunning. And then I've just paired it with some beautiful autumnal flowers from Berkson in Clapham. So beautiful. So I went for this gorgeous like red hydrangea with some eucalyptus. And I think that looks stunning. So yes, yeah, so this is just the plan for this morning. Just get some content, make it look really pretty in here, and just get loads of clips of the my home really, and just make it look really lovely. So yeah, what a really lovely morning. Um, so I'm gonna now do some more pictures of this area, and then I'm gonna go on to the lounge area. Okay, I think I've done like three quarters of what I want to do. I am now going to go to the shops to go and get some olive oil and some frozen fruit just so we have some top ups, get some fresh air, walk in the sun because I won't walk later because it'll be too dark and I don't like the dark. And then later when I have my second coffee, third coffee of the day, I'm going to shoot it in the sofa area and then light some candles and just make it look really snug and do some like little cozy photos. So yeah, so really happy with everything so far, but the sun is shining. So really wanting to get out and have a little break. So I'm just wearing my H&M coat, coach bag, new coach bag actually, and um, my YSL sunnies. <laughs> now well it's nearly midday i'm off to go and get a facial done which is very lovely i've just had a morning of admin and i also had a call which was really cool very dark um but yeah so i yesterday was kind of invited by skinworks to go and get a facial and i've had a facial by them before they're based in soho area i'll leave them down below they also do some really lovely products like collagen and i think skin tablets i think which i've heard people rave about but yeah they've kindly invited me again to go and get a facial and i just I have a kind of a quiet week sense of like socializing and events but I feel like it's actually getting busier um where I've booked things today but yeah it's for lunchtime today I'm gonna go and get a facial which will be lovely because I think my skin really needs it so I'm gonna take you along with me and I'm not too sure what facial it is I think it's the same one I had last time and basically it's just a lot of cleansing and detoxifying uh, the skin and getting rid of like impurities and also as well i believe there's like a i think there's a the led red face mask thing um which i did for 10 minutes last time and that was really lovely so that's just going to get rid of any bacteria um or anything which is clogged up in the skin so really excited for that so hopefully i'll be able to take you along with me um and i'll try and put you on a time lapse just to kind of show the process and i'll also leave down below what facial i get done but first off i'll quickly show you my outfit so my room is a little bit of a mess at the moment because i'm doing a big sort out at the end of the week with e-bloggers and depop so i've got some bits and bobs here 
but that's the reality behind Instagram. But I thought I'd quickly show you my outfit. I'm wearing my Sandro jacket, which I got through Farfetch. I still have a discount code, which I hopefully will have still live. It's Amelia10, I'll leave it down below, and it gets you 10% off your first Farfetch order. Some brands aren't included in the promotion though. And then I paired it with my trousers from Fall From Reckless, and then I'm using this bag because I only have it for a week, I think. This is the Valentino bag, um, which I I'm renting from Cocoon and I just, it's such a statement bag, it's so cool. So yeah, kind of like casual chic. So yeah, so the sun is shining, so let's go and get a facial done. where my sensitivity is but yeah really lovely good morning guys hope you are doing well so i've just got myself ready i actually filmed a hair and makeup get ready with me for a separate youtube video which actually should be live before this vlog goes live so i hope you enjoy that and if you haven't watched it i will leave it on the screen so you can go and watch it or watch it after this but yeah i did that this morning and then i've just realized i am ridiculously late <laughs> I'm off to a little event with JS Health. If you haven't heard of JS Health, have you been living under a rock? It is such an incredible supplement brand, which I've literally just became aware about maybe this year. They may have launched this year or the previous year, but um, everyone's going crazy for it. It really is incredible. So I'm hopefully going to be able to get some top ups. Also to be introduced to, I believe, their new skincare range. I'm not too sure. I feel like I'm speaking literally a million miles per hour at the moment. But anyway, and I think I've had like some spike of sugar maybe. I don't know. I've been taking these hair gummies and I think they've got a little bit sugar in them. I think it's making me go crazy. But I'm ready for the day. So I'm actually in a really cute outfit which I'm obsessed with. So I'm wearing a old H&M coat which I'm just in love with. It's just really big and oversized with some leather trousers, a striped t-shirt and the Valentino bag that I am borrowing and then some boots. This is being sorted out on Saturday. I'm just creating a pile of things that need to go in the attic, which I haven't had time to do. And um, then I've got Claren's presents behind me as well. But yeah, this is my outfit for today. It's a little bit cold today, so wrapping up warm. So yeah, let's go and grab the bus and hopefully get to Notting Hill in perfect timing. <laughs> It 
is time to go. I am snuggled up. It is so cold outside. I've actually just chucked on a different jumper. I'm wearing a big black jumper. And I'm wearing my leather trousers and boots. And I'm wearing my old H&M coat with a Holland & Cooper scarf. And also I'm going to wear my black Chloe bag as well tonight. So an all black outfit. I actually just didn't feel comfortable bringing out the Valentino at night time. Especially walking around. I feel like it's just a bit of a risk so I thought I would bring out my own bag tonight <laughs> yeah I'm just doing like an all black look all snug just fancy a gin and tonic or a cocktail would be lovely um but yeah I just darkened my makeup up a bit that eyeliner I put in my eye I just did it smoky underneath and then I've just done my normal lips just a really casual evening which would be really lovely so <laughs> just made the bed excuse the little depop pile in the corner but i've just put on my lily silk pillowcases as well honestly guys i do not sleep without a silk pillowcase anymore and hands down these are my absolute favorite they're just really soft they're not slippery they're like the perfect the perfect pillow i absolutely love them i just cannot sleep without them anymore also as well they are really good at protecting your hair anti-aging and antibacterial so really recommend giving these a go i shouted them out a couple of vlogs ago but yeah i just wanted to give i wanted to give them another little shout out because i absolutely adore them my fresh bed sheets so yeah that is my fresh bed sheets i've also got a neon diffuser i'm away in the corner just to refresh and like give a really lovely smell up and early this morning i did a little workout had a coffee in bed and now i'm about to walk to sloan square i just thought i'd make the most out of this gorgeous weather and also the time that i have to go for a little walk which i thought would be really lovely i'm actually off to meet my life coach i had previously her name's chantelle marisa i will leave her down below as well if anyone's looking for a life coach how i describe a life coach is i would want to say like i would want to say like maybe a therapist helps you heal from the past a, ther a, a life coach helps you heal from the future so if you have really bad anxiety stressed about um like socializing or or the future or your career or your just like your everyday life then i'd really recommend getting in touch with her she is super lovely and super open and the loveliest person i literally i will i'll put my hands up i cry every time i spoke to her because i just had this emotion come out of me every time i spoke to her because i felt like she really like touched me and like made me feel like i could really open up and it was something that i was i really struggled with anyway because i didn't realize that i had these emotions i was like i'm fine i don't need a life coach but then when I was speaking to her I was like oh my god I need a life coach <laughs> yeah I'll leave her down below she's super lovely really lovely to see her and actually meet her in person and then the rest of the day is just kind of like organizing and getting things done and then I'm going out for dinner with my girlies tonight at a restaurant near me just put on a big River Island jumper hair back makeup on although my skin is purging at the moment from the skin facial I had I own so much like just my skin's like I just bumped into my friend Soph and she said it's purging it's fine it's normal it's gonna be okay and i was like i just needed that for someone to be like oh that's fine and i was like okay i can breathe but yeah it's just like peeling all my spots are coming out but i think that's what the facial was for so um anyway enough rambling i'm gonna get cracking cracking with like some little final bits before i head out <laughs> starting this morning with a new coffee machine 
bear with me because this is the third coffee machine we've had this year <laughs> so hello none of them are actually broken just to clarify both all have been just incredible coffee machines i'm so over the moon and so grateful that i get to try all these out so the smeg one is mine and is from christmas which i absolutely adore but i've been very kindly given the opportunity to trial out some coffee machines so as you previously saw i was trialing out the nespresso one but now that's gone to my parents because they were looking for a new coffee machine and obviously i'm so overwhelmed and so grateful to be receiving all these coffee machines i don't need them all <laughs> unless i have this like a bougie house with like three different kitchens i do not need free coffee machines so yes so that one went to my parents, so I get to go and still use it still, and they are over the moon with the gift, so that makes me really happy. And now, for a while, we'll be trying out the Breville one. So this one, so this one is around a £200 mark, and if you previously watched one of my vlogs, I went to an event to give it a go. So super, super excited to be trying it out at home. So they kindly sent over the Breville coffee machine. Also as well, some incredible martini glasses, so we'll be definitely giving it a go. So let's make a coffee. So I'm going to be running you through how it works. So as you saw, I pushed this button on. This means it's heating up. When that stops flashing, it means it's going to be ready to go. As you can hear, it's just heating up. And then I will press this one later and that will say that that's ready to go. It's super easy to use. So I thought I would do a little time lapse of me using it. And yeah, I hope you enjoy. <laughs> So coffee is finally done. So it's the first time using it and I've got to say I'm not used to the milk frother on this one. Oh, but that is delicious coffee. That is so good. Sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> I'm out of breath because I just had the delivery guy come round and drop off a parcel, but I'm at the top of the building. So it was a bit of a mission running up and down the stairs. That is so lovely. That is such lovely coffee. So that was, if you're looking for another coffee to try, this is the Kickback Coffee Roasting Co. The Espresso Blend. Really lovely. And then we used the Minor Coffee, well, I used the Minor Figures Oat Milk which is yummy so lovely luckily i am on my own this week so i will be trialing out the coffee machine throughout the week just to give it a go and make sure i don't make too much noise um but yeah such a really it was such a good machine and actually when i used this at the event it, it didn't do that so i think it is down to me or my frothy milk in pouring um but yeah so i'm going to drink this which is in the mh mh living cup which is so lovely and i'm going to be editing a makeup and hair video which is going to go live tonight okay and that is dinner served i think people forget how long it takes to make a soup but i was roasting the butternut squash whilst i was doing my yoga and then so i roasted pumpkin sorry pumpkin garlic and then i just let that roast then i added a stock cube and coconut milk and voila got some leftovers for lunch I have some leftover bread from this from earlier and I've just put the rest in the freezer. And then this is my pumpkin soup with some coconut, some chunks of pumpkin, um, pumpkin seeds, which I just grilled. So saving those and they're really good for healthy snacks as well. Bit of chili and yeah, so I'm gonna tuck into this and I am going to watch you on Netflix. I have got a new season so to watch so that's very exciting so i will see you guys in the morning good morning guys oh my goodness you can see my roots are coming in to say hello oh um i'm off to do a little shoot day with india and i might have some visitors from sophie and tula which will be quite cute um we're gonna go down oxford street and then kind of go around that area of like new bond street we're going to go and sit in a coffee shop called Drunch, which do the really cute like Chanel logos on top. And then I have been kindly invited to Sticks and Sushi for lunch. So we're going to do that at 2pm. So yeah, a really lovely manic day. I have an umbrella because it's um, serene and outside, which is just grand. Um, so yeah, so fingers crossed it clears up. But I thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing today. So first outfit is this Zara shorts 
flattered boots, Annie Bing, Anine Bing, I keep saying Annie Bing, Anine Bing t-shirt, Zara blazer, and then I've just put on top my white coat from Fall From Reckless because I'm shooting that later, and then my white coach bag, and an umbrella. So, fingers crossed, <laughs> fingers crossed it's going to be a little bit nicer um, and clear up when we get into Central. This is the current situation <laughs> of us shooting. It's raining. <laughs> it's actually, We're doing it. We're doing I know, great. my hair's dropped and we have little ends. Hello! <laughs> and this is our little bag protection area that India came up with, which is very amazing. You can't copyright it. <laughs> spaceship. Literally. Um, so we're on our second outfit. We're shooting around New Bond Street, which actually is okay with this weather because it's so like open, tall buildings, yeah, bright. So doing our second outfit, we've got like, I've got five, Inns has got six. So I think we're going to try and smash it. Inns, the weather lady, <laughs> thinks it's going to clear up. So fingers crossed this all happens. But currently just hiding under my... My scarf. And My hair is gone. Gone, I tell you. Gone. It still looks gorgeous though. It's hard. But um, I'm in my Sandro jacket that I took from Sophie and I love it. And yeah, outfit number two. I want to do like magazine, kind of like album. Am I in the way? A little bit. <gasps> Can you see me now? No. Hello guys. So I thought I'd carry on this vlog for this evening because I'm with Sarah. I'm shooting a really exciting campaign with Chanel. No, not Chanel. <laughs> oh my God. God, oh my God. that would be a dream. <laughs> Actually, though, no, this is a massive dream of mine. I'm working with Clarence for a Christmas campaign, which is like honestly every time they like message me I'm like pinch myself so we're in the ivy bathroom and it's worked out so well it was mad busy in here earlier when we were like the main shooting of it all and now dead um so yeah so we're doing this for the lip velvet perfecta in the shade over free and if you've known me for a while that the lip perfecta is like my absolute favorite product the matte ones are like creamy it's incredible so that's what i'm wearing now with this gorgeous zara red dress sarah is doing her bit Hold on, baby. and then we're gonna actually have some drinks here because the ivy really lovely complimented us a couple of cocktails so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna go to the christmas tree in covent garden because it's stunning um, and it's red as well which is perfect and that's going to be our transition so after this i will leave the final result and hopefully it's all good <laughs> but yeah sarah's doing her little shenanigans with the products shenanigans. i've borrowed sophie chanelio which is gracias and yeah it's going well so far <laughs> hi <Petal. laughs> Why do I always look like that? I know, literally, I feel like I should do like a montage of me. Like, hi! It's always me coming into the shit camera, like, hi. Oh, I look really nice today. You look stunning. I'm I on Hinge that. and Bumble and Tinder. What else am I on? Oh, I don't know. Raya. Rip. Only important people on Raya. <laughs> I'm on nothing. <laughs> yeah. Cheers, darling. Cheers, biggest. Chin chin. Oh! Nuts are red! Get some pizza now. It's so Christmassy. It's so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> 